as if living in Mexico wasn't already enough, American Airlines just gave me a refund of $30 off my recent fare to fly from Portland, Oregon to La Paz, Mexico. And I'm going to share how I did that and how you can do it too. I'm Brighton and I believe that everyone should be able to move to Mexico before they retire. You don't have to turn 65 and then start living an adventurous life. You can do it now in your 40s or 50s or maybe even your 30s or 20s. So if you're living that dream or you're dreaming that dream, be sure to click the subscribe button and the little bell icon for future videos. So I am a permanent resident of Mexico and a resident of the United States with a US passport. So I'm not a citizen of Mexico, but a resident. And so I, you can do this if you're a temporary resident or a permanent resident, but not if you're a tourist. So this was the receipt that I got for a recent flight down to New Mexico from Portland to Phoenix to La Paz. And you can see here that they charged me $168.24 for a one-way ticket. And you can see that plus fees and taxes is $63.24. And this is where this refund comes in. I bought my plane ticket on American Airlines, so I'm gonna go in here and look up my ticket, but this works on just about any airline. And there's someone out there on the internet who has a really helpful website, Travel With Grant. This webpage is uh, a few years old. However, he's gone through and each of the airlines, so he starts with Alaska, American, and Delta, and tells you how to go about requesting this refund for your plane ticket. Here are the details of that tax. You can look down here and there is a DNI tax. And that's what this uh, this fee is that you can get back as a resident. So this is also sometimes known as a DNR tax or a derecho de no immigrante. And if you're flying on American, they have a webpage. I'll have a link to this one down below too. And this shows different countries that they're collecting this tax for. So Belize, uh, Colombia, Mexico. So if you're a resident of one of these other countries, it looks like you can do something similar there too. But this is it, the Mexico tourism tax. So if you are a Mexican citizen and have a passport, you are a resident of Mexico. So you've got, I like to call it a green card, even though technically it's not a green card, it is a green card. If you are an infant under the age of two, you're a diplomat or you're transiting through Mexico for less than 24 hours. So maybe you got a flight in on one airline and a flight out on a different one. The flight in, they probably charged you that tax if they didn't know you were flying out right away. And you can see here, if you have not yet completed your travel, you need to give them a call and talk to them, talk them through and explain what you're trying to do. And this takes just a couple minutes after the hold time, of course. If you've already flown, you can request a refund through their website. But I found that the, the website was a little bit confusing. So just get on the phone, talk to them, and they'll set you up. And as I mentioned, there's that link to Grant's website down below. So you can do this with other airlines. So before I get to my final quick lesson of the day, I'd love to know in the comments down below, can you share if you did or didn't know about this or didn't know how to do it? I'd love to know if I'm saving people money by creating this YouTube channel. But let's jump into that final lesson of the day, and it's continuing to talk about taxes. Mexico does have sales tax. However, their law says that the sales tax has to be included in the price of an item. So if you're to go out somewhere, the price that you see on the shelf is the price that you will pay. But then when you go through the checkout, they actually divide the tax into a separate line. So it's really super simple. And if you made it to this point in the video, you must be at least somewhat interested in what I have to say. So be sure to subscribe to my channel and check out another one of my videos that YouTube is suggesting for you right now.